Hello everyone. So today we'll talk about how you can change your life by implementing five principles of reiki in your life. So hello everyone. I welcome you all to your own channel, the Ruan Instrument. This is your own Swati Jaiswal, your friend, guide, and healer. So if you are new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button so that you won't miss out on upcoming videos. And if you have already subscribed, I welcome you. So today we'll talk about how we can change our life by implementing five principles of Reiki in our life. Now we all know Reiki is basically a healing modality, okay? And it was founded by Dr. Mikao Yoshi in Japan. Discussing these five principles today, and you will be understanding what are these five principles and how you can change your life by reciting these mantras or these five principles in your life. Now let me just reframe or recollect my statement what is said. It is not only about reciting the mantras or the principles, it is also about implementing them. Because and we will be discussing them one by one. Also, you can take the screenshot of that five principles at the end of the video. I will be attaching that so that you can take a screenshot and then you can recite those principles daily. But please understand, please ensure only reciting will not help you. You actually need to implement that okay but we will be discussing one by one so that you will have a clear understanding what exactly each principle means because when you do something or when you implement something or whenever you're chanting a mantra or an affirmation with proper awareness the results gets manifested right you manifest that result in your life and the results actually multiplies because you are doing it with full of awareness you are aware like what you are doing right and if you're just chanting it without knowing the meaning of it it actually does not create much value it doesn't add much value in your life okay so now the first principle is just for today i will not worry so now if you look at the principle it is so nicely designed wherein we are actually acknowledging it we are letting go of all the fear of all the worry because we as a human have the tendency to live in the future or in the past, right? We absolutely don't live in the present. Never live in the present. We always have a habit of either we will be thinking what will be no next year. So this is very important where you are actually understanding and you are implementing just for today, I will not worry. Just for today, I will not worry as in I will not worry about what is going to happen or what has already happened. I will just live in the moment. I will live, I will let go of all the packages. So the moment you are creating, you know, you are letting go of the worry, you are actually creating the space in your life and you are living in the moment, right? So you are actually aware of your actions, of your deeds, of your thoughts, right? Now, the next principle is just for today. Just for today, I will not be angry. Now, again, we have this tendency and kuch bhi ho jai. Sab se pahle kya aata hai apne ko gussa, right? Anger is something which is like by default. Kisi ne kuch keh diya, kisi ne kuch bhi bol diya. Kami anger bula pahle bula hota hai. How dare he or she like? How could someone tell me something like this? So the first response of ourselves or ours is like you know getting angry if something is not happening according to our wish or according to our desire, right? So we tend to get angry sometimes. So अपने गुस्से अपने गुस्से हो जाते हैं, है ना? अपने आप से गुस्सा हो जाते हैं कि यार ये बने क्या कर दिया? How could I do this? होता है ना? चाहे वो गुस्सा आप किसी और से करो या आप खुद से करो इवेंचुअली वे एंड अप बीइंग एंग्री सो द सेकंड प्रिंसिपल इज जस्ट फॉर टुडे आई विल नॉट बी एंग्री यू नो फ्रीक्वेंट एंगर अगर आप बार बार गुस्सा करते हो इट एक्चुअली ब्रिंग्स बैड लक इन योर लाइफ व्हाई बिकॉज आप ये चक्रास अफेक्टेड होते हैं जब हम वक्त वरी करते हैं जब हम एंगर करते हैं ये जितने भी नेगेटिव वाइब्रेशंस होते हैं वी अन नॉइंगली वी क्रिएट लॉट ऑफ नेगेटिव थॉट्स and those negative thoughts actually affect our chakras knowingly or unknowingly right 
you are heart chakra get affected your solar plexus get affected and then there are many chakras which get affected when you eat anger so eventually hum sochte hain ki hum gussa kar ke kisi aur se ye kar rahe hain but aap apne aap ko hi ruko chahte ho you are hurting yourself only right by being angry so the most important thing is to control your anger i know it's not that easy but you can start somewhere right so just for today i will not be angry that is the second principle and trust me if you start implementing this in your life your life will be sorted yeah. so jab aap uh, stop karte ho gussa hona aap jab gussa hona kam karte ho aap actually shant rehne lagte ho aur aap shant ho aapki dimag shant hai you are actually creating a space aap kitna space create karte ho apni life mein new possibilities ko aap welcome kar sakte ho apni life mein right so stop getting angry so now the third principle is just for today i will do my work honestly now abhi tak apni kya kar rahe the we were clearing right we were cleaning ourselves from the you know negative thoughts negative uh, negative expressions or whatsoever negativity we had we were letting it go and now we are energizing ourselves with positivity because what we are saying in the third principle just for today i will do my work honestly this is very very important very diligently jab aap koi bhi kaam karte ho honestly aap kaam karte ho when you are walking in the path of truth and honesty you are rewarded i know the path is difficult bahut samay bahut sari kathinayan aati hain difficulties aate hain but eventually aap dekhoge when you look back you will feel happy actually you will feel proud of yourself because you know yourself that you have walked in the right path and that will make you happy that will give you the contentment so the fourth principle is just for today i will be grateful now what we are doing we are welcoming positivity we are actually expressing gratitude for all what we have at times we are so overburdened with our own negativity with our own negative thoughts ki apni gratitude ka nahi bhul jata we don't even show gratitude to god to the people around us we are we start taking things and people for granted hai right? na so this is very important when you are actually expressing universe and your loved ones like know that you are grateful for what we have because there are so many things to be grateful of there are so many things to be grateful for in our life we have a home you have a job you have friends you have family there are people who are struggling to make both the ends meet unke paas to work ka khana tak nahi hai hai na so start showing gratitude start being grateful for all we have start showing love and respect to the people you are surrounded with show them the gratitude show them your love and your respect don't take them for granted right and the next principle is the fifth principle is just for today i will be kind to others now this principle is so so full of like so this principle like you know is full of being aware of our own actions so what you are doing here starting may we are letting go of the negativity we and then you know we are absorbing positivity and now we are aware of our actions and the fifth principle talks about being aware like being conscious as in we will be kind to others to our neighbors and to everyone you will meet as in so this principle actually represents it is in giving that you will receive so if you are being kind to others right and if you are being helpful to others kind as in you know in terms of your actions in terms of your words you are helping someone you don't have to help helping someone doesn't have to be monetary always right we always means understand as in like you know jab apne baat karte hain kisi ko help karne ki it is not always you have to help someone monetary aapki ek smile bhi kisi ko help kar sakti hai you never know what the other people is struggling with so even if a smile if you are smiling if you are being kind you are changing the whole the change starts from within right so when you are kind you are actually now radiating kindness to the society 
to the universe and then universe will also bless you back with all those positivity with all this happiness in your life okay so this holding this five principles of reiki if we actually implement in our life i repeat it is not only about reciting definitely you have to recite as well start your day by reciting this five principles because aapko wo apne aura mein apne chakras mein inbuilt karna hai right so this for the next 21 days and say if you are witnessing any change in your life yeah so the five principles are just for today i will not worry just for today i will not be angry just for today i will do my work honestly just for today i will be grateful just for today i will be kind to others so you can take a screenshot of this and recite this principles every day as an affirmation once you get up and it is not always about reciting it is also about implementing so the moment you are getting angry you now recall okay nahi mere ko gusa nahi karna hai i have to you know abide by the principles so the moment you are taking the charge of your life because we are the creator of our destiny so aap jab wo charge lete ho so universe also helps you in aligning your life the way you want to be so aap jab aligned hote ho na aur jab aap apni life mein charges lena shuru karte ho so you actually start work in the right path and then you open the door of possibilities in your life just imagine if you are happy if you are radiating happiness if you are being kind and you are surrounded with all the positivity and if you are doing it daily definitely your life will change trust me just do it for the next 21 days and and fitness and miracle fitness and change in your so do let me know in the comment sections if you are going to practice it and say i am up to practice it for the next 21 days and say and type in the comments i am the creator of my own destiny so that you are choosing a life where you are actually taking the charge of your life and you are creating your destiny you are creating your life you are being happy about your life. okay so stay tuned stay connected i'll see you soon in my next video till then take care god bless